Hello guys, welcome back, it's KK here, and welcome back to Super Mario Land 2 with me and Sex Dude Malloy. Hey guys. Where was the Arnold Schwarzenegger? Oh, I'm oh, sorry. No, Hello, no. how are you all doing on this fine evening? Yeah. <laughs> Is that better? Oh, <laughs> uh, yes, that was, that was perfect. Okay, since we don't need any more coins, let's go for the whole kitten caboodle with 999. You can get a lot of different things like 99 lives and stuff, but let's see what we get. <gasps> We get a misly yes. 20. Boink! Um, but I think 47 lives is actually quite enough. I don't think I'm going to be dying in Warrior's yeah. Castle too much. And that's why I wanted to say today's is... Today is... Bleh, the last episode of this LP. We're going to be tackling Warrior's Castle. Which was castle Mario's Warrior. Castle until Warrior just sneakily flipped the logo upside down. He's waddling on top of the <laughs> castle, all back and forth happily. <laughs> Fat I'm man. I'm surprised he doesn't start throwing stuff at you going, Oh, I missed! <laughs> <laughs> well, let's begin. This is actually a very difficult uh, level compared to all the other levels in the game. Reason being is it's actually quite long. There's many different sections to it, many different obstacles, and there is pretty much no... S Checkpoint, no save point, no nothing. So if you die, like I am almost a rock through close one do it there is no point of return. You have to start all the way back from the beginning. So hopefully I will be won't be doing this too many times. This is pretty much roughly the easiest part of the stage. The next part is a little bit tougher, I guess, because of copters! Ruffle copter blah 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 blah. Actually, Okay, Actually, while we're in Warrior's mm -hmm. Castle, oh. this reminded me... The, sorry, did you want to go, or...? The, no, I uh, died. That's, okay. that's what... Uh, um, it on, just reminded me, now that we're in Warrior's Castle, I actually watched the commercial for this game the other day. You know, the... Obey Wario! Destroy Mario! <laughs> just go... Oh, such, a, such a crazy ad. Just got ye yeah. intimidating Wario it was intimidating. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, well, if you saw a giant, four hundred pound, bulky, chubby, small guy, you'd be scared too, especially mm. with a mustache mm. and a really bad German voice actor. <laughs> <laughs> uh, either that or just just his mm. stare. Ooh, the stare. So I was about to mention before the stupid copter killed me. Apparently it's also slippery. Um, this is where the music picks up. Now comes a little bit of a difficult section. This is where there's traps. Oh, I forgot that. This, the traps are on the floor, and if you press one, you're pretty much screwed from the get-go. Mm. You just have to avoid them by jumping on them. Oh, and falling platforms. Well, more like decaying platforms, whatever. Same thing. But jump, jump. Ugh. And I don't know if it's just my opinion or not, but it seems like they're they this level is a little bit more slip slipperier, more slipperier, <laughs> more slipperier really. Yeah. Yep, that works. Is more is more slippy, you know, it is slipperier, slipperier than the other <laughs> levels. Whatever. <laughs> and apparently, um, I think Mori has a skeleton fetish. Or he just mm. likes death and destruction. Mm -hmm. This level isn't too bad if you're the type of patient person, but I am not patient and I just want to get through this as quickly as possible. This is the worst part of the whole level, in my opinion. These bobble heads. I mean, they're not. They're more like bubble Warios or whatever. But apparently they come in sets of two in the second room, and they can be really annoying because the timing on them can be... Mm. Actually, quite difficult. Okay, it's actually not. Oh, I actually have 69 hearts. That's actually <laughs> very funny. I just realized didn't it, that. It didn't, it, didn't it get. Why is that number it, keep yeah, popping up? Yeah, I mean, up? that number popped up in Super Mario Land 1 as well. <laughs> the coin count at one point. Yes, it did. <laughs> okay, attempt number 3. I swear I will be it before attempt 47. Before attempt 69. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even try me. Oh boy. I mean, seriously. Oh, these 
Piranha Plant statues are a real pain in the butt. Oh, and these spike balls, too. Huh. <laughs> what is with spike balls? Seriously, it's enough that there's flowing balls and you put spikes on them. No! Do not want. It just makes it worse. Ugh. I bet that's what Mario Wario is saying in, in uh, the top floor. Oh, I got spiky balls. Oh, ha, 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 ha. That actually came out really wrong. Never mind. See, guys, this is what <laughs> happens when you have lack of oxygen. Oh, boy. But it's actually good to finish this LP once and for all. Ugh. It's been on my conscience. It's on my will. Whoop. Jump, a jump, a jumpy, Mario. And I don't know why they even put these side corridors in here. That, uh, is it just for show? They just wanted to show the most boring part of the castle. Hey, we needed staircases too. Uh. Or actually, you know what? Maybe they actually had a limit to how long the levels could be, so they actually had to Maybe. make them higher. Maybe that, that is a good, uh, that's a good that's idea. A, that's an interesting idea. Not getting me this time, punk. I'm keeping my f stick on my head. I like my sticks. Oh. But it would be helpful if they actually gave you a little more power-ups in this level. A little more power-ups wouldn't hurt. But then maybe that would make it a little too easy. Maybe. Come on, one more hit. Come on. Come at me. Okay, two, two, two at time. Okay, that was a lucky shot, but I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. What you gonna do when I come for you? Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do? Yeah. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> good fun, good fun. <laughs> what do you mean good fun? I'm being attacked by giant ball bubbles. Oh, that killed me. And gave me a lo weird look. Ugh. Ugh. I'll get you next time, Bubbles. <laughs> it sounds like something from Dragon Ball Z. <laughs> <laughs> well, Bubbles, get back here this instant! <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, and, he, and you just had to have lava, or magma, whatever. In every castle, you just mm. almost have to have lava or magma. Jeez. Has it central? <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it's a, it's the most common fetish. Mm. So, so what do you want? Hardwood floors? You want some cobblestone? Oh, don't forget the lava. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry, it won't burn anything. Yeah. Just there. <laughs> Somehow. Just there. Just just there to cause problems. I mean, I bet Wario when he's like actually might. Oh. And the music glitches out for some reason. No, that was weird. But anyway, it, as Wario's walking to the castle, I bet he's wondering, Man, I wish there was a shortcut to the top floor. <laughs> Jeez, like in Super Mario World, where there's the back door to Bowser's castle. <laughs> oh. And then you get to the end, and ju just... Oh, failure number five or six, or whatever. And I bet just to tick us off at the end, it'll be like, Sorry, Mario. The princess is in their castle. In another castle. <laughs> Actually, Wario's in their castle. He's just taunting you with a. It's like, stuff. it's like you defeated Wario, but Prince <laughs> Peach is not in this game. I'm just going. <laughs> Darn you! Who am I saving? <laughs> My castle? My castle is inanimate. I don't want to save inanimate objects. <laughs> Why are you making me do this? <laughs> I'm not your brother. Go away. Get out of my castle. <laughs> Well, well, he is his cousin, but actually the, the whole purpose... Okay, the fireball just decides to disappear, but the whole purpose of this game, if we didn't mention earlier, is that Mar Mario is trying to save his castle. Actually, he's trying to save the whole world, I think, because Wario put up spell on mm. Mario's world and took it over. I don't know how, I don't know why, don't ask me why. Hypnotized everyone through television broadcast, according to the commercial. <laughs> He just wanted to feel like a dictator for a day. <laughs> yeah. He wanted to have his own minions. Mm. I mean, seriously, if you look at any Mario game, Mario doesn't really even have minions. The closest he has is his brother Waluigi, and I died because of his stupid lava. 
Couldn't you just had normal hard flooring like most of the other residents around the world? Mm. God. Okay. Don't worry, folks. We'll reach there eventually. I mean, seriously, you, you notice that this video has a time limit, and it does end. Mm. So don't worry. We will get there eventually. It probably says finale in the title. Don't worry. We <laughs> will succeed. <laughs> One way or another. If I have to kill Wario myself, I will do it. <sighs> and seriously, what is up with fireballs? I mean, come on. Fireballs from statues? That's so old school. Couldn't you think of something better like electricity, huh? I don't know. Bubbles? <laughs> <laughs> no, don't, don't, don't even push me there. <laughs> I hate bubbles already. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Why? Why? The law was killing more, more, more than usual because it, actually, I remember back in the day, I could beat Mario's castle on the first go. I mean, I did probably go a little slower, but I could do it on the first try. I'm just sucking today. <laughs> we have a lot apparently. <laughs> God. God. Okay, well, we're almost out. Of, we're almost on our tenth try. That that just shows how sad I'm doing. It's all because of you, spiky balls, and bubbles, and lava. I swear that's that that should be the name of like people in a band. Spiky balls, bubbles, <laughs> and lava. I swear that would rock. <laughs> uh. Together they form. War Welcome to die. <laughs> 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 oh, that would, that would actually be from freaking like, or a thousand ways to die. <sighs> I actually brought you to my. Eye. That was actually pretty funny in the original. <laughs> Okay, I actually haven't gotten this far in a while, I think. I don't even remember anymore, I think the lack of oxygen has gotten to me. <sighs> deep breaths, deep breaths. Jump, and hit the ceiling. That's a good thing, hitting the ceiling does not affect any pain to Mario whatsoever. I mean seriously, if you hit your head in the ceiling in real life, you'd say, OW! Especially if it has a stick mm. on your head. And especially don't want to hit those spikes on top. That'll hurt a lot more. I don't want some spikes going through my head. No. No, sir. No, good sir. I don't want any spikes today in my head. Thank you. Ah. Oh. Apparently I'll take spikes in the rib cage, though. Okay. The Revenge of Bubbles. Thankfully, at least they are kind enough to give you almost unlimited time. I'll give him props on that. Then again, there's no real point. Ah! Oh, that was a really close one. Okay. I think we're going to do it this time. I'm hoping. I'm praying. I'm saluting. I'm on my knees. Not really. Come on! You can do it! Hey! <laughs> As a small fry? I don't know how. I wish I had my chili dogs. Oh wait, that's Sonic. Yeah. Oops. Never, never mind. I need my mushrooms then. <laughs> Where's my mushrooms? Or I'll take. I'll take a. F oh no! It was so close. Curse you, Wario, and your bubbles! Don't mock me up there. I'll get you someday. Soon. Someday soon. Uh, that's another thing I question. As we're doing this almost on the tenth try, I think this is the tenth try. Um, I keep wondering, does time actually really pass here? Like, is Mario doing this all in a day, or like in a few hours? Like earlier, he's like, "Okay, Wario just changes the world upside down." Oh, and I take care of it in two hours. No yeah. biggie. All in a day's work. <laughs> or, or like, it's it's an afternoon stroll for him. <laughs> in that case, I'd love to see how Mario. Copes up with Julius Caesar. <laughs> it's like Julius Caesar is attacking Grove and Mario's inside, and he's like, No, not today, good sir. I'm not letting you in. 
Go somewhere else. Shoo. Okay, no no raffle copters are gonna get me this time. Nope, no sorry. Bum bum ba dum ba dum ba dum ba dum. <sighs> okay. So at least that section's passed. Now on to the traps. It's a trap, Mario! It's a trap! <laughs> you just know that you, you knew that pun had to be used. You knew it was coming. Yes, I'm reverse jumping. I'm that big of a badass. Okay. Uh, all we have... Pff, fail. All we have left are spike... Oh, platforms. Well, excuse me, skeleton platforms with spikes and lava. Lovely combination. Every Everyone should have that in their decor in their house. Along with some um, falling spike things. That's always lovely, yes. Always have to have that in the living room. And onto the dining room, we're going to soon have some bubbles. Now I'm going to get you this time with the fire. I think that if you actually... I'm not 100% sure, but if you use fire on these... Wario bubbles or whatever they are called. I don't even give a crap what they are called anymore. No, no. I think it does some damage to him. I think. Maybe. Excuse me. Okay. One more room and then we can... No. <laughs> we can take on the boss. Come on. One more. One more jump. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. We're given a complimentary mushroom for all that pain in the ass work we have to do and presenting Mario Hey cousin jump now what you want to do in this boss battle oh great we're gonna have this is gonna be quite difficult now you just want to jump on his head like most of the other bosses uh, but when he jumps and does a ground pound on the floor he he'll drop that chandelier and if you touch it then you pretty much lose a lot and in this case we would die <gasps> carrots yes Another chance for wings. But we have to match his power of wings. Match the power of my Red Bull. Now it's a little bit more tricky because he's unpredictably gonna unpredictably unpredictably gonna ground pound the floor and it's gonna be painful. Oh god. And oh I actually didn't know that. If you actually um are in the air when he does the ground pound, you will actually be rendered motionless. Okay, oh, one more, one more. This is a little bit more tricky because it actually is a multiple stage boss. Well, it's the final boss, what do you expect? Okay. On for round three, Wario. Can you match us? Oh, fudge. Here we go. Mushrooms versus fire. Who do you think's gonna win? My bet's on mushrooms. <laughs> Well, oh god, oh god. Well, if I hope so. Come on, one more, one more jump. Victory! Yes! Woo! And apparently, even when he's mini, he's huge. Mm. You've been gaining some weight, haven't you, Warrior? <laughs> oh, don't run away from me! And he jumps over the side. <laughs> and with that, my good fellow viewers. That com I was about to say that completes the LP, but what is this? It's Mario's castle. Wait, something's missing. Clink. There we go. And that, my good viewers, is the end, pretty much. So thank you guys for watching. You're going to be present. Ooh, thank you, Mario. Your quest is over. Really? I hadn't noticed. <laughs> I could have sworn we were uh, still going to find Peach, but I, no, I could have sworn bad. there was like an extra quest where you know you go through some other new levels that you've never seen before or something. Mhm. Mm exactly. Well, with that, we present the director Kiyo Take and Hosakawa. And thank you guys. It was a blast doing this LP. Enjoy the music for the credits. It was a relatively short LP. Not too bad. A huge break in between the beginning and the end, but uh, putting that off aside, it was still rather enjoying, mm. especially in green. 
Normally, if you're playing this on the Game Boy back in the day, this would be just black and white. And if you're doing this on different versions of the Game Boy Color or different emulators, you'll notice that the colors would be different. But I prefer the green style because it's green. Mm. It's green. It's a cool color. Oh man, it's green. It's green, ring, 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 ring. Oh, well, thank you guys. This concludes this episode, and this concludes the LP. I'm KK, and joining me throughout this LP was Sax Dude Malloy S26. Thanks for having me on, KK. Well, it was a pleasure having you on, Saxy. Sexy, sexy. <laughs> sexy, sexy cows. Yes. Okay, see you next time. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys, and bye.